Race 37, the Mayors will present the chase. Two miles free, Lord 100. Maggie Whiskey, Hollywood. Miss Midwinter, Patrick Hogan. Orange Cassidy, Matt Cooper. Bull, Nakano, Matt Cooper. Foxtail, Alex Cherry. Love's No Friend, Martin Leiden. Top of the chaser. Trainer so far, and Titch Charles, Alex Cherry. Seven winners then. Martin that's eight, Matt Cooper five, Alex Cherry three, Point Provision two, Derek Inton two, Patrick Ogham one, Martin Keynes one, Daniel French one and John Morgan one. That's the Hunters Championship table at the moment. So all those trainers in this race have had a winner on the Hunters Chase front. Alex Cherry's Titch Jazz is about a length ahead. Of in second place, Miss Midwinter, Patty Organ has only had the one winner. Bull Nakano traps these. I'll jump that one. Bat marker is Love's No Friend. Uh, for Martin leading the top and the chaser at the moment. Tips Jars has drawn two lengths clear of the second place. Miss Midwinter, and then Bull Meccano and then gets Maggie Whiskey, Foxtail, Orange Cassidy and Love's No Friend. I'll jump in the next. And um, the leader is Titch Jars of Bull Meccano. Miss Midwinter probably has the best chance of improving as he's only had the one run. So we could have plenty of improvement in that horse. Um, the class horse in the field is definitely Martin Leiden's Love's Long Friend. It was a 170 rated hurdle up. And we lost him. So Martin. Talk about your horse and it's gone. Ditch Jazz leads by 11 and a half and Miss Midwinter. Maggie Whiskey to the Viennese, and then comes Bull Meccano. Boxtail and Orange Castillo you now back at Marco. The six remaining runners. And Titch Jazz, because next, jumps it well, two lengths clear. And uh, I say jumped it well, he kind of landed steeply, and he's now being joined by Miss Midwinter. Then comes Maggie Whiskey, Orange Cassidy, Bull Meccano. And Foxtail is biding the time at the way of the field, they've still got over a mile to one. They passed this fence and they passed the, the lollipop. As they come past the lollipop, it's exactly a mile from home. Pitch Jars leads from Maggie Whiskey and Miss Midwinter, they jumped that one. Mistake there was by Bulls Meccano, who's now dropped back to the rear. It's being right handed. He got to this one on the side of the goals. And Titch Jazz comes into it. Oh, she took a chance. And I was about feeling it's clear going into the fence, but only had half left to spare now for Miss Winter, the grey in second. Maggie Whiskey in third. Another mistake like I think that'll be the end of Titch Jazz's race because. I might have knocked some stuff in that Oh, him. I stitched Charles heads towards the next two lengths clear from. It is there, because this is a mayor's, isn't it? Yes, it is. And the one that's getting well beaten off now is Bull McCann. The rest have all got some sort of chance. And uh, Titch Charles joined now by Maggie Whiskey. Still there. <laughs> Still well up and jumping well. He's mid winter. He can jump. That's for sure. Well, he's got the pace. Well, stamina for this Maggie Whiskey is just probably just taking it up now from Titch Jars in second. Back in third, Fox Till start picking up some ground in the third. They jump the next. There's a two fill on marker. And Maggie Whiskey pushed along the leads by half flip on the inside. Titch Jars tends to fight back there towards the straight now and down towards the final fence. These two are between them. It could be on the jump in here. Maggie Whiskey, Titch Jars on the inside, just a length away. He's trying hard in second turn towards his final fence. Oh, he jumped it slowly, the leader. And Maggie Whiskey coming along the inside. What did charge? But Maggie Whiskey's gone. Oh, that's close. Oh, I 
quite mad with whiskey held on. Well, it was really flying there in the weather, so I cut my eye close on. Was uh, the all his Cassidy, but Maggie Whiskey's won a big price for Derek Inton. Second was Tip Jars for Lake Cherry. So, so Derek, uh, that's a win for Hollywood. Then I'll take him on the free. 